How's it going, everybody? My name is Xenius, and welcome back to another episode of Knights of the Old Republic. Star Wars, if you guys didn't already know that. Alright, so we are heading off into another part of Terrace. Um, we're gonna says defend this guy, I guess. Payment. Here, I I've got 50 credits, a down payment. That should find me some time, right? Sorry. You're out of time. Now it's all or nothing. Davik can't have people not paying his debts. But I don't have that much. How can I give you credits I don't have? That's too bad. Davik's going to want to make an example of you. Somebody help! Somebody you? They're going to kill me! I know we have to be careful about drawing attention to ourselves, but we can just let them drag this guy off? Hold on a second. Looks like we got ourselves a witness here. Devin doesn't like witnesses. Leave this man alone, or you'll have to deal with me. Guess we'll have to teach you to mind your own business. Uh, no thanks. I'm just gonna teach you to not mess with this guy ever again, and I'm gonna miss right off the freaking bat. I suck. I am, I am horrible. Thank you. I owe you my life. Those bounty hunters are going to take me away and kill me. My life warned me not to take a loan from Davik. Now I can't Sorry. pay him back. It's not good to owe a crime lord money. You just keep sending more bounty hunters after me till I'm dead. I, uh, I don't have any credits, man. I'm just glad I could help. Right? That's I'm all I should do. I'm getting out of here before any more of Davik's goons show up. You should do the same. Okay, yeah, no problem. I'll, I'll, I'll bounce right out of here. Um, another thing about, uh, this part of the game, I don't remember what I'm supposed to do or where I'm supposed to go. I remember that the medical center was an important part, so that's why I went there first, but I don't really remember a whole lot. I, I know that I'm supposed to get down into the Undercity somehow. I don't remember how I do that. To the apartments. Sure, I guess, I guess we'll go here. The, I, I know that a, a lot of, uh, not a lot, but um, part of this game no is just problem. kind of going around and exploring, like the whole walking into people's apartments, woman, child, you guys, you guys do anything fun? You got anything fun in here? Any, uh, any good things? Oh, you got some credits. Hey, thanks guys. That, that always weirds me out, when you can just go into people's apartments and take things, like, Oh yeah, this is normal. People do this on the reggae. It's, it's fine. I can't remember what... Oh, maybe this is it. Just move along. There's nothing to see here. Well, I don't really know about that. Sith uniforms? Did you sell them to the Terizian underground? Start talking. I want answers. Please, I am only a visitor to Terrace, trapped here by your quarantines. I know nothing about the Trigian underground or your missing Sith uniforms. What's going on in there? You're a little too curious for your own good, civilian. This doesn't concern you. I know all about Sith interrogations. This isn't going to end well. I'm getting sick of your lies, you alien scum. We've got your ugly mug and a security tape from the base. Start talking before I splatter your slimy brains all over this room. Uh-oh. Command is losing his temper. I'm glad I'm out of here. It took me an hour to clean the blood stains from my uniform after the last interrogation. Oh, come on. Stop the interrogation right now. Who said that? What's going on out there? Just stay out of this if you know what's good for you. Oh, shut up. I won't let you kill a defenseless prisoner. What was that? Did I hear you right? Let us kill him? How can you stop us? Watch me! Time to teach the civilian the penalty for defying the Sith. Dun dun dun! Light side points! You're dead! Commander, let's go ahead and shoot. No! Okay, you're just an idiot. Come on, Karth, help me out here. Bada bing, bada boom. Oh, come on, you had a footlocker. Thank you, human. The Sith would have killed me. Of that I am certain. I don't know who you are, but it is clear that you are no friend of the Sith. You are absolutely correct. Among my people there is a saying, the enemy of my enemy is my friend. Like you, I hate the Sith. That is why I stole those Sith uniforms for the hidden Vex. 
Uh, Sith, we're right, you are a spy. In the lower city, there are some who do not bow to their conquerors. Swoop gangs like the Hidden Vex are gathering resources to one day strike against the Sith oppressors. If you wish to strike another blow against the Sith, you would be wise to journey to the lower city and speak with Gavin Thek, the leader of the Hidden Vex. Uh, can you take me to Gaddon? Access to the lower city is restricted. I have never actually met Gaddon. My only dealings were with the member, or with the members of his hidden Beck gang. Uh, can I get one of those uniforms? I'm sorry, but all the uniforms I had were given to the hidden Becks. I suppose you could take the uniforms from the bodies of the cis soldiers in this room if you wanted. Uh, sure, yeah, I'll do that. Sith know my face now. I must find somewhere to hide on this world. Thank you once again, human. No freaking problem. Uh, so I actually kind of lucked out there and went to the place that I was supposed to go. Uh, so I know what you have to do now is you have to equip the Sith armor and then you have to go to the underground entrance. Uh, this is not a, I think this is it right here. Uh, which is on the other side of this little area right over here. When I take a right and talk to someone, I'm allowed down uh, into the uh, Undercity. And that's when the rest of the story starts taking place. So, uh, something seems to be bothering Karth. Maybe you should speak to him and see if you can get him to open up about it. Um, this is a really cool concept. You actually get to talk to the uh, quote-unquote supporting characters, uh, and they have their own backstory, which is really, really cool. I, I think this is an amazing concept uh, oh, yes, to add to a game. Mind. I'd like to know more about you, Karth. Me? Well, I've been a star pilot for the Republic for years. I've seen more of my ship, of course. I fought in the Mandalorian Wars before all this started. But with all that, I've never experienced anything like the slaughter of these Sith out of Not even the Mandalorians were that senseless. My home world was one of the first planets to fall to Malak's fleet. The Sith bombed it into submission, and there wasn't a damn thing the Republic forces could do to stop it. You're talking like it's your fault. Like you failed somehow. It shouldn't be my fault. I did everything I could. I followed my orders and did my duty. That, that shouldn't mean I failed them. I, I didn't. Them? Do you mean the people of your homeworld? Wait, I'm sorry. No, no, no. I'm going to say, I'm sorry, Karth. I didn't mean to upset you. No, I, I know. Don't worry about it. I just, I must not be making much sense. You probably mean well with your questions. I'm just not accustomed to talking about my past very much. At all, actually. I'm more used to taking action, keeping my mind focused on the business at hand. So let's just do that. If you have more questions, ask them later. All right, cool. You get to do that with pretty much every single member of your party. You get to ask- What is this planet coming to, huh? <gasps> Shlami's just walking around the upper city. Shouldn't you go to Lars says you belong, Shlami? This is what you Yeah, like he said. These streets are for upper city citizens. <laughs> you better get out of the way if you know what's good for you. Okay, yeah. Uh, hey, guys. We can all be friends here. Let me buy you a drink. A drink? Hey, hey. for a Shlami, you ain't so bad. Come on, boys, this slummy's buying the next round. <laughs> no way, forget it. No more drinks. We're laying them off as it is. Uh, uh, yeah. I guess you're right. Maybe next time, slummy. <laughs> Come on, fellas, let's go. I just love that. That was, I loved that. That was hilarious. Uh, I want to avoid this guy right to my left. I don't like him. I think he's, I think he sucks. Let's go ahead and change into the Sith uniform. I wonder how that conversation would have gone if I had been in the Sith uniform. Like, all of your conversations with people are different when you're in Another Sith guard. Another patrol heading down to the lower city. Well, good luck. I heard it's pretty rough down there. There's a big swoop gang war going on, you know. You better watch yourself. Those gangs will take a shot at anyone, even us. It's too bad we don't have the manpower just to sweep those slums clean. As evil as the Sith are, I do have to say that it they are a galactic government that is trying to make everything better. Uh, it is trying to bring order to the city. And I, I have to say this about the... Um, 
I have to say that about the movies too. Like the Galactic Empire, everyone was like, "Oh, it's evil. Oh, it's bad." And yes, they did do evil things, and they did run on slavery. But you have to remember that the entire galaxy was in a time of war, and the galaxy was tired of that war going on. So the Galactic Empire had to have been a relief. Like it's the end of this horrendous war that is ravaging our our home, the place that we live, and we, we, we live in fear because we don't know if it's going to hit our planet next. And so the fact that the galactic government came along and offered the galaxy peace, that was, uh, that was incredible. That was revolutionary. Um, so yeah, same here, honestly. Vex are nothing but bantha fodder. The Vulkers are strongest. We'll teach you who the strongest. Ugh. Oh, I think we found out who's strongest. I think it's uh, I think it's the Vulkers. Goodness. More strangers. Should be attacking me. That's fine, right? Karth, Karth, help me out here. Karth. That hurt a bit. <laughs> that hurt a bit. Owie. What's everybody doing? I think now that I... Oh, gosh. I am not doing well. I think now that I am, like, up close and personal, I think me having a sword would probably be better. Because now that I have Karth and he's kind of my long-ranged... Uh... Attacker, I guess that's um, that's what I would call him. It. Uh, it's a uh, it's a little bit better, and I'm I'm kind of the front runner. I'm the person on the front lines. There's Cantina. Uh, I think this is an easy way to get. Oh, can I not go in until I talk to him? All right. Cool. Thanks, man. I think that there's a type of fighting match in here? Oh, come on! Oh, it's Kalinord. Never mind. Go away. Hey, you not talk like that. We just want to say hi to Big Bad Bounty Hunter Kalinord. Uh, this can't be Kalinord. He's supposed to be tough. This guy's nothing but a runt. One. What? One? What that mean? You be funny, tough guy? You know who we are, Kalo. We're members of the Black Volker gang. You don't want to be getting funny with us, tough guy. Two. Me no understand. One, two? Why he count? He trying to count uh, how many of us is against him? It's three against one, Kalo. What do you think you, uh, what do you think about those odds? You have one more thing to say? Three. Sup, Kel? Go away. All right, yeah, cool, no problem. Nice work. Fine. Oh, oh crap! I keep, I, I haven't saved. Fine, I get it. I'll leave you alone. Smart. Wait, hold on. I. Yes, I know. Who cares? Save game. Save it. Yes, I'm sure. Now talk to him again. See what? No, come on. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Fine, don't. Whatever. Who cares? Uh, that's actually one mistake that I did one time. I actually did try to, uh... Uh... I did try to... Fight him one time, and he, like, killed me right off the bat. I have not seen you here before, human. You are new to the bounty office, yes? My name is Zax. I'm the one in charge here. Are you looking for work? Uh, there are many bounties available here, legal and otherwise, but they all pay quite well. Oh, are you here for information? Everybody knows I'm one of Davik's best agents. I'm the hut with all the answers. Uh, oh, wait, uh, hold on. Gurney said I should speak. Oh, no, I don't want to. I don't want to do this. Tell me about the. Oh, no, I, I meant to. Tell me about the bounties. There's two government contracts. One's an assassin named Selvin, the other's Bindex Starkiller. He's a famous deathmatch duelist. Between him, they've killed hundreds of people. I can't see anything wrong with getting rid of people like that. 
long as we don't end up on the list of your victims. Lit. But not all the bounties are dangerous. Davik got some special contracts. Once for a girl named Dia, she attacked Holden, one of Davik's men. Another for a man named Larga, who owes Davik money. Okay, I don't know about Davik's special contracts. Justice is one thing. But doing a crime lord's dirty work is something else. And then there's Matrix. He used to work for Davik, but he betrayed the exchange, and now Davik wants him dead. I'll put all this information in your data pad. Awesome, I'll be going now. Okay, so I'm probably not going to do all of them. I know the one with Dia, there is a option. Um, I don't remember what their story is, but I know that there are options for a light side. Uh, this game is all about choices. You have the option to either uh, kill a person or save them. And I think that's how it is with Dia. Uh, you have the option to either save her or kill her. Um, and obviously, I want to play this as close to canon as possible. So, hey, I'm going to go light side. you can't just walk in here. This is the hidden back base. How do I know you're not a Volker spy sent to kill Gadon Thek? I need Gadon's help. I was told to speak to him. A lot of people want to go inside and speak to Gadon. He's a hero of the common folk. But the days of the Hidden Beck's open door policy are gone. Between the Sith conquest and the Volker gang war, Gadon has more enemies than he used to. We're being careful about who we let in now. Maybe I could be an ally against all those enemies. Well, we do need all the help we can get. And you don't look like you're with the Volkers or the Sith. Besides, it's not like you can do anything to harm Gadden in the heart of his own base. Not with Zeandra watching his back. Zeandra watching his back? So you're going to let me in? Go in and speak to Gadden if you want. Just remember to be on your best behavior. The hidden Becks are watching you. You got it. Thanks. Thanks so much for your hospitality. Hold it right there. Who are you? And what is your business with Gadden? Calm down, Zedra. Nobody's going to try anything here in the middle of our own base. It would be a suicide mission. You're too trusting, Gadden. Brezhik and his Volkers want you dead. Anyone we don't know is a potential threat, and it's my job to make sure you're safe. Do you want us to start attacking strangers on sight, Zedra? Like the Volkers do? I will never let it come to that. Now step aside and let them pass. As you wish. You can speak to Gadden if you want, but I've got my eye on you. You try anything and you'll be vaporized before you can say Volker Spy. Thank you for your hospitality. You'll have to forgive Zerdra. Ever since Brezhik and the Volkers began this war against us, she's been a little overzealous in her security duties. The problems with the Sith haven't helped things. Zerdra seems to forget that I know how to look after myself. Now, how can I help you? Uh, I need information on those Republic escape pods that crashed in the Undercity. The escape pods? You know, I heard the Sith have been asking around the Upper City about them as well. But you don't look like you're with the Sith. They nope. might be spies, Gadden. They might be working for the Sith. Calm down, Zerdra. If the Sith thought we knew anything useful, they'd have a battalion of troops kicking down our door. No, I think this offworlder has his own agenda. Don't worry, I'm not working for the Sith. I suppose I could tell you what I know. It's not like it could do any harm to me or my gang. But it might cause problems for the Vulcas, and that's okay in my book. The Vulcas stripped those pots clean within hours after they landed. It's too bad we didn't get there first, considering what my spies reported the Vulcas found. A female Republic officer named Bastila survived the crash. We Bex don't believe in intergalactic slavery, but the Vulcas aren't so picky. They took a prisoner. Bastil is a slave? What will happen to her now? Normally, the Vulkers would take a captured slave and sell them for a nice profit to Davik, or an off-world slaver. But a Republic officer is no ordinary catch. I still think Bastil is just a Republic officer. That could work to our advantage. Maybe she'll even figure out a way to escape from the Vulker base on her own. She's too valuable to leave with the Vulker scum at the base. Brezhik's probably got your Republic friend hidden away somewhere safe until the big swoop race. You'll never find her. There has to be some way I can help her. I'm afraid your friend has become a pawn in Brezhik's game to take over the lower city. He's offered her up as the Volker's share of the prize in the annual Swoop Gang race. By putting up such a valuable prize, Brezhik hopes to win the loyalty of some of the smaller gangs. Their numbers will allow him to finally destroy me and my followers. So how do you propose we go about rescuing Bastila then? Well, we can't fight all the gangs. The only hope you have of rescuing Bastila is to somehow win the big season opener of the swoop race. 
Gaddon, can you help me with this? I might be able to help you with this. If you'd be willing to help us. We both have something to gain here, and much to lose. What are you proposing? The swoop race is for the lower city gangs only. I could sponsor you as a rider for the Hiddenbecks this year. If you win the race, you'll win your friend's freedom. But first, you have to do something for me. My mechanics have developed an accelerator for a swoop engine. A bike with the accelerator installed can beat any other swoop out there. But the Vulkers stole the prototype from us. They plan to use it to guarantee a victory in this year's swoop race. I need you to break into their base and steal it back. How am I supposed to get inside the Volker base? Getting into the Volker base won't be easy. The front doors are locked tight. But I know someone who might be able to get you in the back way. Mission Vale. Mission? Gaddon, you can't be serious. She's just a kid. How is she supposed to help them with this? Mission's explored every step of every back alley in the lower city. Plus, she knows the undercity sewers better than anyone. If anyone can get inside the Vulcan base, it's her. Where can I find Mission? She and her Wookiee friend Zalbar are always looking to stir up a little excitement. They like to go exploring in the Undercity, despite the dangers. Your best bet is to look for her in the Undercity. But you'll need some way past the Sith guard post at the elevator. I've got some Sith uniforms to disguise myself. A simple disguise might have worked on the upper city card. But the security down here is much tougher. You'll need the proper papers to get past it. Luckily, my gang ambushed one of the Sith patrols headed down to the Undercity. They never made it, and their security papers fell into my hands. Since we're working together now, I suppose I could give them to you in exchange for your uniforms. With the security papers, you won't need a disguise anyway. Uh, um, okay, I'll trade the uniforms for the papers. Good choice. Thanks for the uniforms. You won't need them with these security papers anyway. Now, is there anything else I can do for you? Uh, I'll be back when I get the prototype accelerated. I suggest you hurry. The swoop race is coming up, and we want you to have time to practice before the race. Awesome, thank you so much. So, this one part uh, that we're about to do uh, when we get mission and we break into the Sith base and we break into the Volker's base and all that yada 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 jazz. Um, I think it's this way. I li I cannot remember. I always get confused on which way I need to go. Um, anyway, I'm pretty sure it's this way. And this part has always been the hardest for me. Oh man, really? We're back already? What the heck? Oh, I'm getting better. I'm getting better with this whole sword thing. Sort of. Thanks, Cart. How'd you like that? Let's rock and roll. Uh, no. Zigzag. Serpentine! Serpentine! Okay, maybe that was not a good choice. Garth, I need some help here. Oh, hold on. Grenade him. Boom! You can get him. You can get him. Come on. Come on, Karth. Oh, gosh. I thought that was it. That sucked. Sure. Maybe I should actually start leveling up my characters, you know. The, uh... Can I move now? Please? Can I, can I move? Can't move. There we go. Yes, what's on your mind? Nothing, nothing. I don't yeah. know why. This is weird, guys. I can't move, actually. Ready. Garth can. Sure. I cannot. This is weird. Uh -huh. Hold on one sec. We're just gonna go to the next area, I guess. Our corpse. Okay, my character is moving though. What? Why is he stuck? I'm what? so confused. Volker. Okay, I think I went the wrong way. <laughs> That's great. I don't know what to do about my character, guys. So, um, the reason I, I looked at those bounties uh, in the cantina down here is because there's a part coming up, and I don't remember where it is, that, uh, uh, yes. that kind of, come on. oh, come on. I'm just here to take blaster fire, that's all I'm here for. 
cars. Time to rumble. And boom goes the dynamite. Oh. How'd you like that? oh my gosh, I thought cars were taken out. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and Ready. get you a med pack. Yep. I think it's one of the most nerve-wracking things for me. You guys are behind with your payments. What do you, uh, you think just because you're in some gang, you don't have to give Davik his cut? Uh, I don't see Davik doing anything for his share. We do all the work, Davik claims he's part of the exchange, so let's see him prove it. Yeah, let's see the big crime lord come and get his money from the Black Volkers. Ah, so you want to play this the hard way? <laughs> okay. Oh, hey, Candorous. Uh, we, didn't, we didn't know you was looking for Davik now. Yeah, we were just goofing around here. We don't want no trouble with Mandalorian. Here's Davik's cut. I knew you boys would see reason. Now get out of here. Too bad. I was looking forward to cracking some heads. Oh, we'll get that to that later, Candorous. I better get this over to Davik. I'll call you if anyone else gets behind on their payments. Awesome. Thanks so much. Can I move now? Hey, I can. Freaking finally. I don't want to talk to you. You're freaky. Candorous is one of those characters that just like you don't realize that you like him so much until it's too late, and you just you like you need him basically. Another one of those. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna stick with that. We're gonna stick with Blaster because running up to someone and getting shot at just uh, getting shot at while you do it is just not fun at all. So I'm gonna stick with it. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We're all fine. Can Karth level up anytime soon, please? Oh come on! Fine. I'll keep fighting. Please don't take another hit. Come on. Alright. We're doing alright so far. I might do the thing where I level up if I get hit again. Yeah, it's just one. I don't know how much vitality I have, though. Right, we're doing alright. We're doing fine. Oh, man. I can really use Candorous right about now, but, you know, it's fine. Back. What? <laughs> what? You just got owned, Candorous. That, uh, Karth, whatever your name is. What? That's cool. I forgot about the rapid transit system. So that's one thing that I do like about this game, is that you have choices. Um, one of the cool things is you have hold on there civilians only those with official set business are allowed into the undercity unless you've got the proper security papers you better just turn around and go back the way you came I've got my security papers right here let me see uh, yeah these look to be in order okay you can go down if you want can't say I envy you though the undercity is crawling with mutants rack goals they call them if you see anything moving down there, shoot first and ask questions later. You got it, man! I do like that you have characters who kind of align with different beliefs. Like, Karth is very uh, much light side and tries to draw you in that direction, and uh, other characters there, that you meet. Upworlder! Anyone using this elevator has to pay the toll! Oh, really? Yeah, this is our elevator. If you use it, you gotta give us something. I don't believe this planet. Even the beggars are trying to shake us down. Five credits! That's what it costs to use our elevator. Five credits! <sighs> you know what? It's just five credits. Okay. <laughs> credits, my brother! We have credits. Now we can buy food and medicine. Hush, or the others will hear us. They'll want our credits. We have to hide them. Go on, you two. Get out of here. Oh, uh, thanks. I'm sorry about that. Those two beggars give everyone in the village a bad name. We aren't all like that, you know. Most of us are good people. Oh, I'm, I'm okay. sure you are, miss. It's just too bad your little welcoming committee is here to give people a bad first impression. My name's Gail Jarrett. Uh, who are you? <laughs> My name is Shalina. 
You're from the Upworld, aren't you? Mm, yeah. I've, I've never seen it. I was born here in the Undercity. Is it as nice as they say up there? Uh, it's nothing special. Not to you, I suppose, but my, my chair keeps you're probably used to its beauty whatever. by now. It's fine. I've never been to the surface, but sometimes I think I can see it in my dreams. The sun, the sky, the stars. It all sounds so, so, so wonderful. Gendar, the leader of our village, tells me Sorry. I should spend more time trying to improve things down here and less time dreaming about something I can never have. Maybe he's right. You probably think I'm a fool, having dreams of a place I've never even seen. But when I was little, Rukil used to tell me stories of what it was like up there. I want to ask you some questions. You'd probably get more information from Gendar, the village leader, or maybe Rukil, but I'll tell you whatever I can. Awesome. Uh, do you know anything about the escape pods that crashed into the Undercity? I don't know anything about that, but maybe Gendar could help you. Sorry. Is there anything else you need? No, I understand. I'll be looking for oh, Gendar. okay. Well, if you ever need anything, or if you just feel like talking, come back and see me. I hardly ever get a chance to speak to someone from the Upworld. Thanks for telling me nothing, I guess. This place always creeped me the frick out. You're, you're Gen Gengar? No, you're Rukul. Gendar. I don't think I needed to talk to them. I think I can literally just keep going. I I'm gonna go ahead and save, because I haven't saved in a while. I almost died earlier, and I don't want that to happen again, so. All right. Oh, man. Oh, this guy. I don't like this guy. You ain't from the village. You're from the upworld, ain't you? Credits, I bet. Not really. Watch yourself. There's something slimy about this guy. I wouldn't trust him as far as I could throw him. My name's Saigir. I run a little salvage shop here. You want to buy something from my store? I got some good deals. <sighs> uh, sure, let me see your inventory. I the best stuff. Mostly salvage and such, but the price is right. Okay, Chani, battle armor. Super freaking expensive. Just like everything else. Whatever, who cares? You no, know what? I don't want to buy it. I do love the voice acting of this game. Like, there's just something what? so good about everything that's done on what? this game that I, I absolutely love. Hurry, um, Hendar! Hurry! I can hear it coming! He'll never make it. He's doomed. <sighs> I told him he was a fool to leave the village. He will make it. Run, Hendar, run! Hendar? Open the gate! Oh. Quickly! Isn't that who there I was supposed to talk time. to? Yeah. Gen I, Gendar, I that was it. The Rackles are too close! The mutants will kill him if you don't open the gate! And if I open the gate, they'll kill us all! No! You can't do this! It isn't fair! Ooh. Please, make him open the gate! Hendar will die if he doesn't! I can't open the gate. Not while the Rackles are so near. Open the gate, I will kill the Rackles. You'd risk your life for a stranger? You're brave, Upworlder. I'll open the gate for you, but you gotta be quick. In a few seconds, I must close and lock it again. You got it. I'm gonna go ahead and switch to the longsword. Uh, because this is a close combat fight, so why would I... Come on, Karth! Oh, thanks. Now I'm poisoned. Oh my gosh. Wow. Goodness, man. Alright, I'm out. Woo, boy. That was rough. Alright, one more time. One more time. Alright. Sure. Maybe we'll do something better this time. Alright, the car's taking a beating. I'm taking a beating. Car's taking me. Okay. Woo! We got him. We got him, boys. Did not like that one bit. Not like that at all. Uh, no. I gotta stay out here, dumbass. Crappity crap crap. Alright. Blast pistol. Is that really what I was doing? I guess so. Alright, cool. That's fine. Car is not doing alright. Give him a med pack. What? I'm not doing alright. Give me a med pack. 
All right. Please, you have to help. Yeah. Me. Nobody else is gonna help me. Even the Bex won't help me. But I can't just leave him there. He's my friend. You'll help me, won't you? You're missing Val, right? Gadden Thex said you could help me. Gadden? What? I don't know what you're talking about. Please, Zalbar's in trouble. He needs our help or they're gonna sell him into slavery. Zalbar, you mean your Wookiee friend? What happened? Me, me and Zalbar, we were just wandering around here in the Undercity. You know, looking for stuff we could find, just kind of exploring. Yeah. We do it all the time. Yeah. I guess with a Wookiee at your side, you've got to figure you can handle the odd rat ghoul attack. Only this time, they were waiting for us. Gamorian slave hunters. Oh, uh -huh. We didn't even have a chance to run. Big Z threw himself at him and then roared for me to run. Well, that's a Wookiee for you. I, I took you. off. I figured Zalbar would be right behind me. But there were too many of them. He couldn't get away. They're going to sell him to a slaver, I just know it. Oh, uh, well, uh, do you know where they took him? I don't know for sure, but those Gamorians like to hang out in the sewers. The stink reminds him of home, I guess. Yeah. That's probably where they took Big Z. Uh, if I help you get Zalbar back, you have to get me inside the Volker base. It's a deal. As soon as we get Big Z back, I'll show you a way into that Volker base. Now come on, we have to find Zalbar before they sell him to slavers, or worse. Do you know where he's being kept? The Gamorians make their camps in the sewers. I bet that's where we'll find Zalbar. And that's where I'll show you the secret entrance into the Volker compound. Uh, okay, awesome. Let's rock and roll. Let's do this mission. <laughs> Get it? We're doing this mission with mission. <laughs> Alright, uh, I think... Ooh, mana fragmine. Uh, I think mission has huh? better... Uh, I think she's better at this than I am. I don't know if she can recover it, but I'm pretty sure she can disable it. That was a minor frag of mine. Why didn't I even try? Did I get it? Okay, awesome. Let's try and recover it. Is that a guy over there? That looks like a guy. I've never seen that guy ever in my life. Republic soldier. What? What? Sure. Hold on one sec. Okay. I have played this game dozens of times. And I've never seen this guy over here. Help. Help me. Uh, no. Oh, yeah. I don't have the, I, I don't have the cure. I'm so sorry. Skin. Some... Uh, yeah. I'll see. Uh, no, no, I can feel it. Ah! Oh no. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, this is an unnecessary. You guys can. You guys can attack at any time. Oh. And. And. Fine. We'll level up now. Ugh. All right, uh, I'm gonna go with demolitions. What? That's a class skill now? What the heck? What was it? Feats. I feel like, uh, well, we can't do toughness. All right, hold on one sec. Saving throws, uh, plus one point to demolitions and stealth. Not really my forte. Persuade, treat injury, repair security computer use. Plus one bonus to all saving throws. I'm gonna go with that one. Uh, I've never fully understood the whole saving throw concept, but uh, <laughs> pretty sure it's important, so we're just gonna go with it. I should probably have. You'll pay! Come on, come on! Woo! I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm down and out. Down for the count. I thought I could. I thought I could look at that. I guess I can't. Sure. That's weird. I like how Karth has yet to actually level up. Can I not do anything? Huh? Whatever. All right. I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode here. We are now in the Undercity, and we are finally looking for Basila, and we finally have Mission Val. So, uh, we kind of have our heading. 
um, I know the next step is us finding Zalbar, and then we have to break into the Volker base. Um, so that's probably all going to be summed up in the next episode. But um, yeah, I'm. I love this game. I will always play this game, and I love that I can play this game for you guys. So if you guys are enjoying it, please drop a like down below and let me know if you guys want me to continue playing it or not. But uh, I'm I'm pretty sure I'm going to anyway. <laughs> Whatever, it doesn't really matter. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please drop a like down below, and I will see you next time. Bye bye.